Hello, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Maker. And look what I have. I have me a spider farm. String farm. Okay. Um, let me show you. I've been wanting to turn this on, but I've been wanting to do it on camera, and I haven't been able to get, uh, get some time for that. Oh, I hear a zombie somewhere. Look at this. I found a dual uh, spider spawner. These are the nasty little cave spiders. Um, this is the, uh, and they intersect. They're, uh, the spawning areas actually overlap, or if they don't overlap, they're really close. They're like right on the edge of each other, and they're offset a little bit. You can see the spawner up there, the upper spawner, uh, and you can see, uh, that they're offset a little bit. So I did, so I had to sort of figure out the right sort of arrangement here. So I'm going to turn this thing on. Um, I'm using ice. To place the water because I have an ice farm and it's really nice to be able to place it knowing where it's going to go and uh, not have to worry about it so that's very cool so let's go up uh, you notice that there were lights the the spawners were not actually spawning spiders because I've got lights up there which is very cool so I've got one switch down over there which controls this block of lights and this block of lights. Woo! Alright, now I just need to figure out how to get inside. Because I've been rearranging things a bit. Ow! Okay. That's okay. So this is the, uh, the redstone to turn on the lower lights. Runs along here. The lights are just on the other sides of these blocks the other side of these blocks okay and then this is da -da -da. and I have another spawner down here this is a skeleton spawner and when I found it and when I was working on the spider spawner I was using an older snapshot which had a bug where spawners would spawn no matter what the light level was uh, so that wasn't so great. You couldn't turn off spawners. <laughs> that was that was a bit of a challenge because as I was working along, I could kept all these little tiny spiders kept popping out and biting me and making me a little bit crazy. So that was no fun. Um, and uh, oh, I blocked it completely off, didn't I? Okay. Um, I think we're in here. Oh. No. How do I... This will work. This will work. So I place these blocks back. Okay, so what happened was these guys would just be spawning like crazy and I'd be running around trying to kill them and keep myself from being too poisoned. Um, no fun. So what I ended up doing... Ah, okay. Oh, there, duh. Okay, good. Um... So I ended up filling this the spawn volume almost completely with gravel, surrounding this thing with gravel. And what would happen is the spiders would spawn inside the gravel because that was another bug in the snapshot. And as a result, they would uh, they would suffocate, and then they would drop their string and spider eyes, and they would pop up to the top of the gravel. So I ended up with almost a double chest full of string just while building this thing. So I almost at this point I almost don't need it string farm okay so this should be enough distance there should be eight blocks here aside from this so if I break this ice it should flow just up to the edge oh nice okay and I do not actually need an ice block on every block here um, uh, 
every other would do as long as I got in the corners okay so now these guys should spawn in here the water should push them into this gap I hope this gap is, is wide enough it's only too wide um, I know that the the big spiders are wider than that but these guys are one block so that should be enough I think we'll find out and if not I can adjust it because I can turn the lights back on and and uh, make these guys stop spawning all right so this switch here basically turns on and off all the lights um, I may want to move the switch it shouldn't be too hard it's basically you can power these redstone lamps with just redstone laying on top and then I just need to stir it up to the, the ones up top not that bad uh, and then I've got some oh that's right I put some in the edge down there because it was a little too dark Oh, I should have looked. I made sure I removed all of the torches from the upper chamber. Boop. I think we're good. Okay. Same thing down here. Oh, that's right. So, because of this overhang, to, to maximize, to get the full water flow up to the edge here, I had to extend this these three blocks which made these blocks, which means I could only put in overhead lighting in this area while still leaving my two block gap. Uh, and then these areas over here were getting dark. So I put in these lamps. That's why that there's that extra stream of, uh, of redstone running behind this wall here. It's all probably horribly confusing. I get confused, so but that's fine. And then this flows. Oh no! Did I miscount? I did. This is awful. Uh oh. And I have a slime over there somewhere. Oh, this is interesting. So, what am I going to do? I don't know. I'm going to have to figure this out. I'm going to. I'm going to make sure that that my calculations were correct here. And they were not. I have to rebuild this whole freaking thing. Oh, this kind of sucks. Alright, I miscalculated. This was supposed to flow over this top layer of, of hoppers. And, uh, and then push them right into the cactus. Okay, well, you know what? Let's go grab the extra cactus. Let's go find that slime. Uh, where's my cactus? And, uh, let's, let's try turning it on, seeing what we get. It, it will somewhat depend on the spiders being idiots. Well, hello! How'd you get in here? Hi guys, give me your slime balls. Nice. Let me clear this out. Right, two, two torches. All right. Oh, of course I. Well, those torches on the wall inside the lower chamber shouldn't matter so much. Let's go turn it on and see what happens. I obviously am going to have to do some re-engineering, which I will do off camera. Ah, I hear the spawning. Oh, that's just wonderful. Now, if I stand here, the spider should actually want to come and attack me, right? Right? Hello, dude. Where's that zombie? Dead end. Oh, I have some dark area down there. So he's probably down there. Na 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 na. Okay, so how do I tell? Are they? Oh, somebody's dying.
Somebody's dying and there's some string. Okay. Well, at least in theory this will work, right? Okay. Okay, so this isn't this isn't completely awful. Are they trying to get out of oops? Ow, ow, ow. Don't walk into the cactus. Okay, well. <laughs> okay, so obviously I didn't do enough unit testing while I was designing this, but that's okay. So um, that will be my string farm. Again, I don't know how much I need for string. Um, I, I managed to get quite a lot of it just while working on the farm itself. More than enough for the uh, the witch farm. Building materials. So see, I got a ton of string here. Uh, not a full chest exactly, but if I do this, they'll stop spawning. I'll still need to go in and kick their butts. A little free eight-legged. See, they're they're hanging out on that strip, and I don't know what to do about them climbing the walls because they can do that, of course. Once I get the stream flowing into the cactus, hopefully it's not, you know, not so much of an issue. Uh, so anyway, welcome to this episode of Theron Cannot Count. And, uh, yeah. So anyway, this is what the string farm is going to be. We and egg get all done with it. Um, obviously this will be a few blocks further that way. Which is not a problem because I was a little cramped here anyway. So, there we go. Excellent. Well, thank you for watching, and uh, I will get this fixed, and we'll we'll do a little do a little recap. You probably won't. This is uh, I'm recording this on July 31st. Oh, hello, Iron. Why didn't I see you before? Um, and I uh, not be. Oh, let's use dirt. Um, and I'm going to be going on a cruise leaving on Friday. I will not really have time to uh, publish this uh, before then. So this will be, I've got a little bit of a backlog, so this will probably be weeks before you, uh, you see any of this. But um, I wanted to get it on camera because it was supposed to be a little bit more triumphant than that. But... Mm. So what happens, um, I do plan on sheathing this whole thing in stone brick and uh, making it a little bit more uh, presentable from the outside. But anyway, that's the spider farm or the string farm. Um, I will get it fixed up and uh, show you show you what it looks like when I'm all done. Uh, so I think that's it. Uh, thank you for watching and I will see you later. Bye.